and welcome along to another video. Um, my legs are wrecked <laughs> after yesterday, so I'm just doing a gentle spin today. And I was trying to think of ideas for motivation to get me out cycling this morning because the sun wasn't out again. Um, we talked to a few members, they're also struggling with motivation for cycling. I asked Abby what ideas she's got for a video today, and she said, cycling bingo. So today, I'm going to launch cycling bingo. I'm going to take some photos for you to try and find uh, similar items on your rides and take photos and see if you can complete cycling bingo. Should be a bit of fun and I hope you enjoy it. Let's get on with the ride, it is a bit chilly. The sun's fighting to come out. It is still very windy and my legs feel like lead after yesterday. <laughs> so we'll see how this goes. <laughs> So item number one is a public footpath sign. I should point out, it doesn't have to be that one. It can be any public footpath sign. These aren't specific to the ones I'm finding today. These are ones that are specific to your rides and the rides you're doing. You just need to tick them off. Something to do. Item number two. A town sign. Any town sign, just a town sign or a village sign. So here is item number three. A new road that you've never cycled down before. So this is a new road on me. Don't think I've ever been this way before. Take it off. Find a new local road that you've never been down before. Is it number three? I'm losing count. <laughs> yeah, the road I'm in is called Perry Lake Lane. I've never been here before. Judging by the road surface, there's a reason why. <laughs> it's not great, but it's a new road. Yeah, don't come down this lane. The road surface is terrible. I've been sliding all over the place. A cyclocross bike would have been better, don't you? I've got it there somewhere now. I don't even know where. Get myself lost. I can't even blame Commute for this one because I picked this road. <laughs> mistake. Big mistake. Don't quite an obvious one. A gate with a view. I know you've all got an obsession about uh, finding gates, but can you find one with a view? Not a bad view either. I had to come up a horrible climb with potholes to get here. <laughs> Stick to commute. Don't, don't go off plan and try and make your own route. <laughs> There's a reason why we don't cycle these local roads. <laughs> the next one is a diversion sign. Obviously followed by the next one, which is a horse. That's quite handy from coming around the corner. Saved me finding them, didn't it? <laughs> So the next two, diversion and a horse. Move on down the hill. Um, I'm actually not that far from home, I am. I've only done 11k. <laughs> um, and I'm pretty much lost. I don't know roughly where I am, but I've never been down any of these lanes whatsoever. I think I'm coming down on the, um, the Wells Webmore Road in a minute. That was the plan anyway. But I could be cycling anywhere in the world at this point, so. Check out your local lanes. Just beware of the road surfaces. <laughs> All right, so I'm back on the main road. Um, sign over there says we're in Yarley. Um, but I've also found the next one. And unsuitable for heavy goods vehicle sign. They always mean danger. <laughs> back that way means road surface. <laughs> on the road uh, to Easton. So there was some lanes in there I didn't even know existed. But there we go. Take you to Yali of all places. There we go. 
Next one is a post box. You get bonus points if you can find a gold post box. So, wouldn't be a treasure hunt with me without a treasure hunt. Wouldn't be bingo with me without a post box, would it? Next one, a church. Let's all pray you find that one. Getting bonus points for the prettiest church you can find. Of course. And we're also going to do a post van. If you can find a post van without any dents in it, bonus two points. There aren't many. <laughs> and no through road sign. Easy. <laughs> We've all suckled at those, haven't we? <laughs> I just had a message from Del, she's out cycling. I'm gonna see if I can catch up with her and have a little chat. Probably miss her completely. <laughs> Let's add some traffic lights into the mix, shall we? The next one's traffic lights. Let's also add in an old phone box, just for nostalgia. There's not many of those left, so that might be quite hard to find that one. Reason that even the characters even love. out today they're either walking running or cycling but there's a lot of people a lot of people venturing out in the sun not really locked down anymore is it hello <laughs> oh, weird today weird yeah i don't know i've lost motivation this week why is that I'm missing the roof i think we're missing everybody yeah well i went out for i don't know 40 minutes on wednesday yeah <laughs> and then just went home because i didn't feel it yeah might have something today that might help Oh yeah. <laughs> Today's video, yeah. Abby, yeah, yeah. Abby suggested cycling bingo. Oh yeah. So I've done cycling bingo. I found a load of things for you to find. <laughs> I think I need something to go for. Uh, up until now I've been fine. Yeah. The hills are getting better as well, I think. From the Strava anyway. It's not quite the same, is it? I keep getting lost down bed ends and stuff. <laughs> so I'm actually finding places, but in the wrong way. So you're cycling loads of new roads? Yeah. Yeah, Every day. The roads that go nowhere. <laughs> yeah. We've been back from Mallorca today. I know. Um, yeah. I tried not to think about it really. I've tried not, well, I can't not think about it, but. I know. Yeah. I still want to go in September, but whether the. We were talking about it and the cafes and things might not open alongside the holidays. Yeah. So then there won't be any point, will there? Yeah, there's a lot of people out there. I don't know whether you noticed. Loads yeah. of people. Yeah. Cars, walkers, yeah. runners, cyclists. Wookie Hub is pretty like buzzing today. Yeah, there's loads of people there, yeah. isn't there? I was a bit surprised when I cycled through. And, well, walkers, cyclists, you know, they're just, I suppose, not all standing in a huddle, but yeah, more I think, than the I think everybody's realised they can get, they can actually go out. You haven't got to stay in the house yeah. as long as you um, stay away from people. Yeah. But yeah, I'm just... My average speed has gone down because I'm just footling <laughs> around, enjoying the Mine is 20.2. What the heck? <laughs> Mine is probably that's, 10 that's, or something. That's kilometres an hour, not oh, miles an hour. Right, that's right. <laughs> My legs are a bit dead from yesterday. Well, quite, why? What did you do? I went up Will Abington Hill. Pete challenged me. Uh, oh, I haven't watched that one yet. What? No, I've been working. What? It's been a long, long week. And it's just been getting home and then yeah. drinking too much. <laughs> <laughs> Dermatology is going to be very busy after this crisis, and alcoholics and all this. <laughs> <laughs> the birthday. Yeah, yeah, really enjoyed it. Yeah. No pressure, just lovely, weird presents, bananas, honey, <laughs> <laughs> marzipan. The drive that I did in the morning was freezing cold, so that was disappointing. Yeah. Because for the last few years, my birthday has always been sunny, I think. So I went out in shorts and regretted it instantly. <laughs> There's loads of people cycling in twos. Yeah. But then they do look, like, a lot of them do look like husband and wife or... Yeah. But the two lads aren't husband and wife. No, no. They're only brothers. <laughs> I, saw, I saw three people cycling together yesterday. There was, there was two waiting on the corner 
and they asked me if I'd seen another cyclist because they were waiting for somebody. Oh, right. And then when I was dying at the top of Wallavington Hill, all three cycled past oh, like five, as a group. Four races, they like, I've noticed that they are flying past on some of my rides. It's lovely to see you. And you. Yeah, it's mm. nice. You're only the third person that I've bumped into since lockdown, I think. Uh, I think I'm on four. Colin, Ollie and you. Was, and, was Ollie um, a blur? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> we might like this today then. Yeah. Cycling bingo. Okay. There's, yeah, a, okay. there's a load of things for you to tick off. There we go. It's nice catching up with Dale. Having spoken to her this morning, she's lacking a bit of motivation. So this cycling bingo is for you, Dale. I hope you enjoy it. Um, hope you all enjoy it. So don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and we will see you tomorrow. I think Pete's doing the 26 climb challenge tomorrow. So I'm going to go over and see Pete do a few of those reps. See how he's getting on. Thank you again. And we'll see you again soon. It's come out all glorious now, got him. So I should say, um, don't forget to tag your photos to hashtag cycling bingo on Instagram. So we can see all those. I'll be able to find all those. We'll put them on the Mendit Cycling Club page on Facebook. Looking forward to seeing all what you come up with. So thank you once again, and we'll see you soon.